Hello everyone, this is Dylan G. Nelson speaking to you here. Welcome back to another video. Today is Thursday, December 15th, 2022. And today's video is going to be about a comic book series that has been rejected by three different studios three times. And that is Bone. So, what's this video going to be about? Is will the Bone comics from Jeff Smith ever get a movie slash TV series adaptation? Now, if you don't know what Bone is, I'm pretty sure a lot of older fans know what Bone is and some newer fans. But if you all don't know what it is, I'll just tell you because I got it all written down from pen to paper by using my phone from Wikipedia. A site that is good to use so yeah so let's get started so if you don't know what it is I'll tell you right now bone is an American independently published graphic novel series written and illustrated by Jeff Smith originally serialized in 55 irregularly released issues from 1991 to 2004 the series was self-published by Smith's Cartoons Books F for issues numbers 1 through 20 by Image Comics from issues numbers 21 through 27 and back to the Cartoon Books for four issues numbers 28 through 55. Man, that was hard to read. So, about that adaptation. So, yeah, numerous attempts have been made to adapt the books all or which have failed to come to life. In the late 1990s, an attempt was made by Nickelodeon Movies to produce a film adaptation of Bone. Jeff Smith said in a 2003 interview that Nickelodeon wanted the Bone cousins to be voiced by child actors and wanted the film soundtrack to include pop songs by the likes of NSYNC. Smith was critical of this proposal. So it never came alive, so that is attempt number one. Now, attempt number two. In March, uh, in March 2008, Warner Bros. Pictures bought the film rights to the series. Smith's website confirmed on March 13th that he had made a deal with Warner Bros. to adapt the Bone Saga into a film series. Further information was given in July of 2011 citing that two scripts have already been written and rejected. A third is currently in the works and will most likely yield three separate computer animated 3D films in... Okay, I pause. In January of 2012, Patrick, C, Patrick Sean Smith, the creator, of the, the creator of TV series Greek, was hired to write an adaptation in that... P.J. Hogan was attached to direct the future to be produced by Lynn Pictures and Animal Logic. In November of 2016, Mark Osborne had been hired to direct the animated adaptation for Warner Animation Group. Osborne, along with Adam Klein, were set to direct, uh, set to write the film which would have been the first in a planned trilogy. So attempt number two never happened. Now let's go to attempt number three. In October 2019, the project was picked up by Netflix for an animated series after Warner's turnaround of the project. However, in April of 2022, production on the series was canceled during a reorganization of Netflix animation. So yeah, it was canceled. Early 2022, it's all written on paper. Get it back. So yeah, I got it all written down. So yeah, will the bone comments from Jeff Smith ever get adaptation? Well, yes. Even though three attempts, yeah, even though the three attempts never happened, Apple TV could pick up the series because you know what, Apple TV has been turning the, you know, their book projects into movies slash TV series. So yeah, I'm pretty sure it's gonna happen. I know, maybe a different, 
site will pick this up. Wow, my words are turning around in my head. I need to pause this. I think I finally got it out, so. Yeah, another different streaming service could pick this up, like Apple TV, Hulu, Peacock, not Disney. Disney should not pick this up. But yeah, or even Amazon could pick this up. Netflix, Warner, and then Nickelodeon just rejected it. So, yeah, I know Jeff Smith wanted this to be an adaptation for a long time. It's been rejected three times. And that sucks. It's almost 2023. I mean, if Netflix wasn't in the situation, I mean, the Bones series could have came out, or at least came out next year. They had an adaptation of Cuphead. But yeah. That's all I gotta say for this video. What are your thoughts? If what are your thoughts? If you want the bone comments from Jeff Smith, the good adaptation, like a, a movie slash TV series, kind of like Netflix is what it's doing to Redwall, the series about mice. That's all I'm gonna say. So, yeah, I know Jeff Smith could be happy if this ever happened. If if one day Apple TV Plus decides to call and say, hey, we're going to work on this project, we will feel sorry for you that um, that these three cities have rejected your stuff a lot. So yeah, we're going to try and make this as close to the comments as possible, and we're going to make it great. And Jeff Smith could be happy about that, but I'm pretty sure one day it's going to happen. I know this bone comment is going to be picked up by a different streaming service, so yeah. I'm suggesting Apple TV could do good since they signed that deal like two and a half years ago with Maurice Sendis books and those you know projects are not even out yet and there has been no updates ever since so I don't even know what's happening there so yeah that's all I gotta say what are your thoughts on this will you, will you see this on TV one day put them in the comments I would like to see your thoughts so yeah, that's all I gotta say. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to this YouTube channel that I'm trying to create the best content that I'm trying to do. And yeah, no offensive comments, take constructive criticism easily, and no toxic people. Can't stand them people. And also, they have to be, if they like the series about Bone. So yeah, if you don't like it, don't watch this video. So yeah. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out for the ladies and also for the gentlemen out there. Peace out.